Hi. Welcome to Math Den. A series of math topics tutorials. This covers algebra, geometry, trigonometry, probability, statistics, calculus, and business mathematics. Today's topic is the rational function and examples. What is a rational function? The previous topic about polynomial function is important and prerequisite to rational function because rational function is the ratio of two polynomial functions meaning two polynomial function in a fraction form here is the definition a rational function is defined as a function in the form of f of x equals to p of x over q of x where p of x and q of x are both polynomial functions. p of x is the numerator function, while q of x is the denominator function. But there is a condition. q of x must not be a zero function, meaning the denominator must not be equal to zero for all values of x. For example, we have this function, f of x equals to x squared plus 6x plus 5, all over x cubed minus 2x squared minus 15x. This is a rational function, because the numerator and the denominator are both polynomial functions. The degree of numerator is 2, while the degree of denominator is 3. Another example, we have this function, f of x equals to x minus 2, all over x squared plus 4x plus 3. This is a rational function, because the numerator and the denominator are both polynomial functions. The degree of numerator is 1, while the degree of denominator is 2. One more example, we have this function, f of x equals to x squared minus 1, all over x squared minus 4. This is a rational function, because the numerator and the denominator are both polynomial functions. The degree of numerator is 2, while the degree of denominator is also 2. How about this one? Is this a rational function? We have f of x equals to the square root of x minus 2 all over x squared plus 3. The answer is no. This is not a rational function because the numerator is not a polynomial function. It has radical in the expression. Take note that variables with radicals and fractional exponents are not considered polynomials thanks for watching see you on the next video don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell for more video tutorials